Hello everybody, welcome to my creative time with Emma. Today I have a real quick uh, video tutorial for you. Um, this is explaining to you how to put all the little pieces together. This is from Loyal Friends that we just, um, we are releasing today, um, which is Friday, June 27th, 2014. Um, only because if, for those of you who uh, decide to purchase this, there are several dies that come with this. Um, we have the the little fence, the little house, and what have you. Um, all the doggies, the little speech, um, little cloud die. So I'm just going to quickly show you how when you cut these out. So basically when you do get these, just so you'll know, you need to cut them all apart. Otherwise they won't work. Okay. Um, and then it has the coordinating stamp set here. And then I'm going to show you which eyes and which little spots go to each doggy, okay? So let me grab my board. I have all the pieces cut out for you already. Okay, hopefully that's in the camera there. Okay, first of all, before I show you like the little house and the little fence, I'm going to show you these parts first, okay? So, let me kind of... Okay. So the little stitch cloud and that little dot and this little popcorn-y thing looking thing is part of the actual message bubble. Just like so. Okay? So that's your message bubble. Okay? And then this little piece, okay? Let me, I'm going to get a pointer here for you. This piece along with this piece are the ears for this doggy here, okay? Let me grab my tweezers really quick here. So what you want to do is this one here, the look the thinner one is the one that's going to go on this side. So let's go ahead and quickly I'm going to quickly put this together for you. And I'm just going to use some liquid glue really quick here. Okay. And this ear is going to go like so, okay? And then that other ear is going to go on the opposite side. Just like that. Okay, isn't that so adorable? And then for the eyes for this doggy, it's the first one here. Well, see, if you were to look at it, this is uh, upside down, so if you want to turn around so you can read the actual um, sentiments. It's this one here on the lower left where if you look at it, it has two little dots with like an oval shape at the bottom. So that's his face for him, okay? So let me get a little, oopsie. Let me get an ink here. And then you just go ahead and stamp his little face on. Okay, like so. And then, oops, I'm still going to need this. Um, skip the middle one, but the, this one over here, that's the spots for him. Okay, so let me grab that one. And then you could go ahead and stamp the spots just somewhere on, on his back like so okay and this is just my particular this is my take on it if you can however do whatever you want to these doggies you know what I'm saying however you want to switch up the little eyes and nose that's fine that's just my take on it and I wanted to show you so you wouldn't be confused on what goes with what okay so that's the first doggy okay let's go ahead and do the second cutie patootie dog okay so now on the stamps it's the center one here that's the stamp that goes for this little doggy here. So let me go ahead. And this one is going to go right here. Oops. Just like so. Okay. So that is that one there. And then. And that's a super easy one. You don't have, 
You don't even have to put spots on this one. I just thought, you know, it just reminds me of my angel. Okay, so that's that one. And then we have the cutie patootie doggy. <laughs> Looks like he's on a timeout. And this is the one I had made where if you decide to put a face on here, just make sure you cover up the tail or something like that because it, it's, um, I call it the little timeout puppy <laughs> because it's facing, you know, away from you. It's facing the opposite direction. So for that little guy there, right above the paw prints, there's three different spots there. You, those are to put spots on his body. Like I said, you don't have to put spots on it. Um, you could just leave it plain. Like I'm going to make one that's all black to look like my princess because she's always looking out the window for us. All, all of mine, except for Scrappy, he's too short. But all the um, Angel and Princess are the ones who usually look out the window for us all the time. Okay, so for this one, it, this one just gets stamped like so. Kind of looks like an arrow, so that's where you know you're doing it right there, okay? And like I said, you don't have to use these. So Veronica actually put some examples for us here, how the spots go and how the little eyes and nose go. I don't have an example for the little kitty patootie doggy right here. That's why I wanted to show you the actual video on how these all go together. Okay, so those are the pieces and I'm just going to quickly show you the little house and the fence. Okie dokie, now I'm going to show you the rest of the stuff that's cut out. We cut, we used everything on here except for the bone. I want to show you what the cute little bone looks like. And then here, I cut everything out for you. So let's go ahead and show you the little fence first, okay? So let me grab my, um, hmm, where did I put my tweezers? Oh, here they go. Okay, so basically... Here goes the first part of the fence. You could just use this all by itself. I have a little piercing in them that kind of, you know, oops, outlines the inner part of the fence. And then here goes the other part here. Okay, this goes like so. One of my design team members actually did a really good idea with this when she created, when she put her fence together. Okay, let me put this on here first really quick. And you could also do this in a different color if you want. Like I said, whatever you want to do. Well, anyways, you know the little, um, all these pieces here for the speech bubble? She actually used this and put it here, but of course it was in a different color. She put it on one, two, three, four, and she made it look like, or she just did three, I can't remember, but she made it look like little nails in the fence. How clever was that? Okay, so anyways, how super duper adorable that is. And you can use this fence for anything, really. Um, and I have all the measurements, if you're worried about what the sizes are of each item, I have all the measurements in the little section in the regular, um, where all the price is in the store here. Okay, so here goes the cute little doggy house. Um, this here... These are all like cut lines just to kind of give it some kind of definition. I thought it came out really cute. Now I have two options here. This is the cute little doggy opening there. Okay. And you could go and I have a couple of items here. Oh, you know what I forgot? Let me, I forgot one thing. Hold on. Sorry about that. I forgot the little cutie patootie little paw print. You could do one or two things. Okay. You could go ahead and put this at the top there. Decorate it with that, or you could decorate it with that, like so, or you could put the little doggy bone right here, okay? Or if you want to switch it up all together, you could actually use this as a little birdie house and just put that like so and decorate it however you want, okay? That's why I have the little circle there. I thought that was kind of cool to do something like that. Um, but anyways, this is what we have right here. Let me just put this down right here. Um, this is everything that's in the set of dies. I just wanted to quickly show you exactly how 
everything goes together in these in this one set called Loyal Friends. I do have another set that I also released today called Live Laugh uh, Live Love Bark. Okay, which is this one right here, and this comes with a, just a coordinating die. Super simple. I don't have to show you that. It's just a simple die. Um, you can use these sentiments that will go with this set perfectly as well. Okay, everybody, I hope this helps you out. Um, so as soon as you get this set, refer to this video. Um, this should be a huge help for you. So thank you so much for tuning in, everybody. Have a fabulous day, and I will see you back here soon. Bye-bye.